Aloha. This is Trinidad, the island man, your island man, coming to you live once again from beautiful Hawaii here on the island of Oahu, bringing you, yes you, the best unboxing videos on the entire island of Oahu. And uh, yes, still not giving you any uh, movie or TV show reviews. Um, gosh, uh, maybe, you know, by this weekend that will change. There are a couple of movies uh, that are currently um, on video on demand uh, on the streaming services in the Halloween uh, genre kind of thing. So I'll go ahead and uh, kind of give you an update on those and review of those uh, coming up. But currently we are doing an unboxing video and here we have Amazon, two Amazon boxes of purchases that I've gotten and that we are going to go ahead and open up for you right now. Um, as you know, today is the 13th of October. There is a Amazon Prime Day, which is supposed to be this great uh, super duper deal. Uh, again, I didn't see anything uh, special on Amazon Prime as of yet, uh, but it's still early. It goes through today and tomorrow, the 13th, 14th. But I had uh, seen these on deals earlier, so I figured I'd pick them up, especially with Halloween coming up. So let's take a look at this uh, package. Now, as you can see, can't really tell what this is. <laughs> uh, but I saw it and I thought it was pretty cool and I thought I'd give it a shot. Now, uh, let me warn you that uh, this is actually uh, for, oh, oh, actually, wait a minute. This, <laughs> this is something totally different, I'm sorry, uh, than what I thought it was going to be. I thought this was going to be for Halloween. However, <laughs> it is not for Halloween. This is for everyday consumption and use. Um, this is underwear. Doo -doo -doo. You know, uh, these are boxer briefs uh, that I really like, uh, or at least I've found on Amazon that I really like. Um, made out of like bamboo. Uh, let's see here. Uh, yeah, ninety-five percent bamboo, uh, five percent elastine. So, you know, uh, I find that the bamboo is kind of like a s tougher, you know, yeah, kind of a, like a tougher and cheaper silk-like material. It's very soft, uh, very nice. Uh, they advertise it as being uh, much more absorbent than cotton. And I found that it is, and it whisks a lot better. Uh, you know, here in the tropics of Hawaii, it is kind of hot and humid sometimes. Um, you know, and if you're not using, you know, the right amount of like, say, uh, powder <laughs> or cornstarch, uh, in your neither reg re regions, um, it, uh, it could, uh, hinder your performance all day. Uh, let me just say that. Uh, however, I found that these bamboo underwear are extremely comfortable, um, and extremely soft and Generally, you don't have uh, the same problem as you do with maybe cotton briefs. So I do like these, and whenever I see them on sale on Amazon, I go ahead and I pick them up. Uh, they are kind of expensive, especially compared to uh, your most, uh, you know, cotton uh, briefs, of course, you know, Hanes or whatever. A uh, pack of five here was about uh, $40.00. Um, but you know, if you're a guy, you're not really, you know, this is the most I've spent on underwear for a long time. Uh, <laughs> let me just say that, you know, uh, girls, you know, when you get your guy and, uh, you know, they still have their underwear back from high school, <laughs> you know, they wear it, especially on Sundays around the house, their holy underwear. <laughs> Um, you know, and that's their religious experience, I guess. Um, you know, so most guys, you know, can afford to, uh, go that little bit extra mile and, and splurge, 
you know, once, at least once in their lifetime for some nice bamboo underwear and check them out. So yes, these are very comfortable. I highly recommend these. Uh, go ahead and check them out when you can. Um, all right. <laughs> Moving on from that surprise unboxing, uh, which I didn't expect to be showing you my underwear here. Uh, we have another Prime box, which I think is probably what I was expecting to be unboxing here a second ago. Much more of a Halloween-y nature. <laughs> Those uh, underwear were a little bit of another type of weeny situation. All right, so here we go. Uh, again, all these were on the deal days that I preferred my shopping with. Um, some loofahs. Loofahs. Uh, now I have some old loofahs, but you know, since the pandemic and everything's been shut down, um, usually I pick up like a big pack of loofah for the shower uh, and my bath. Um, you know, at like Ross. You know, they're cheap. But since I couldn't get, up, get over to Ross because they're all shut down, uh, at least they were uh, due to the pandemic, uh, I went ahead and picked up some extra loofahs. Now, you know, I have one that's kind of fraying and falling apart in the shower now. Um, so it's always good to have these four spares extras uh, you know, to use as a backup. And uh, so these should be really good. And uh, plus, these are a little extra special than what you just pick up but At Ross, says here's Soft Soothing Charcoal Scrub. So we'll check these out and see how they work. But here you go, four pack of loofahs. And these were about uh, $12. So not too much more expensive than Ross. Uh, plus they're a little larger. All right, so what else do we got in this box? We have some extra gloves, as you can see here. But what kind of gloves? These are bike gloves. I do ride my bicycle. Uh, I try to commute uh, on the weekends. Uh, I have some half finger gloves, which are nice, but unfortunately those weren't on sale. Uh, ooh, these are a little tight. Uh, these were medium to small. Um, the other ones that I have are extra large. My hands are probably about a medium. But don't worry, ladies, not everything is medium. It's, no. <laughs> um, all right, but you know, no Trump hands here. But as you can see, these fit very well. And uh, my bike has a little bit of red. So I got the red ones to match my bicycle, as you can see. Uh, these have a nice kind of little bit of reflective tape around the edges and on the fingers. Um, I've never tried the full finger gloves for bicyclists. It's, it's pretty hot here, but I was thinking that, you know, every once in a while, you know, you do kind of stub your finger a little bit, uh, maybe on the pedals or not the pedals, but on the handlebars, reaching for the gear shifts or, you know, lifting, picking up and moving your bike around or checking the tires or something. You get, you know, kind of scraped up a little bit on your fingertips. So I'm going to try these out. Plus, you're here in Hawaii. You put sunscreen on. And, you know, during the day it wears off. And especially now that you're washing your hands all the time, um, you know, it's going to wash off of your fingers, your, you know, that sunscreen. And your fingertips aren't going to be as protected. You're going to maybe get them burnt, especially if you're going on long rides, holding onto the handlebars, getting hit by those UV rays of the sun. So here you go. Full fingered gloves should protect you uh, much better. Uh, they fit really well, nice and snug again, uh, once you stretch them out a little bit. Uh, these were the medium to small, and they were like $7 um, for a pair of these. The ones that I got at the bike factory were like $30, $40, outrageous price. I just bought them because they were helping me out with my tire one day, which, you know, didn't really pan out. You know, they weren't very appreciative that I purchased a product from them anyway, so Amazon was the way to go the second time around. <laughs> All right, now to the last, but not least, of, oh, actually, maybe not quite the last, but the almost last. For Halloween coming up, it is October, I saw these deals, a uh, bunch of silly, like, little superhero type of items. Um, to have fun with. 
Uh, here, as you can see, you have Spider-Man, you have uh, Superman-like costumes, a Batman-like costume, and a Captain America-like costume. However, these are the masks and the capes. So, now I like Spider-Man. I am going to go ahead and probably use this for Halloween. Now, it's supposed to be for little kids. Uh, I'm taking a risk believing that it would fit me. Uh, okay, now these are cloth and felt, so they should be very comfortable. As you can see, you can put on the mask. Uh, it's a little tight, uh, but there you go. Doo -doo. Uh, much more comfortable. I had another Spider-Man half mask like this that was a little bit more uh, harder plastic and it would hurt my nose. This one being more felt and cloth uh, should be a little bit more comfortable. And it comes with a cape, as you can see here. See, a very nice, beautiful Spider-Man cape. Okay, now this is something that I did not see uh, from the video in uh, in the you know in this product but i was afraid that the cape would just be fit over your head and being an adult it wouldn't fit me but it does have a little velcro strap so let me put on this cape because it does have this velcro strap that you can put it on and so now i have a spider-man shirt that will go good with this and voila see there you go i put on this spider-man cape the spider-man mask and i'll be ready to web swing wherever <laughs> and like you can see here uh, there's a Captain America one a Batman one and a Superman one as well so all you need is like you know some blue sweatpants red sweatpants uh, for Spider-Man black sweatpants for Batman uh, you know a Batman logo t-shirt Superman logo Spider-Man logo t-shirt that I have and you're all set for Halloween nice and simple nothing crazy you know you can go greet uh the kids at the door with these without any uh mess or fuss all right okay well great so that worked out pretty well and last now last but not least something that i really wanted to check out was these uh these are mask straps now not for halloween uh these are little hooked elastic straps uh, that stretch and also are able to expand slightly and uh, you use these for your mask currently um, a lot of people especially if they're not using those gator necks uh, are suffering from ear strain and stress uh, after having to wear their mask for an extended amount of time as you can see you know this is a KN95 which I also bought from Amazon a while ago I have a few more of these, but uh, I had to, as you can see, makeshift my own little elastic band with some paper clips here. Um, it's, it's okay, but you know, sometimes it still comes loose and then sometimes um, being metal and sharp paper clippish kind of a thing here, it kind of hurts sometimes. So. Um, it's nice to be able to maybe check this out and get, you know, the proper tighter seal with uh, these hooks to, you know, which just hook on. Now, there are other types of these, but I saw that these automatically had the hooks on there. So, hmm. Okay, now without just uh, without adjusting it, so far, a much tighter seal on these, and oh, definitely a lot more comfortable uh, than I had with just my little, uh, you know, makeshift rubber band strap or or hair scrunchie that I was using with a couple of paper clips. Uh, I think I'm going to enjoy this a lot more. As you can see, a much tighter seal, uh, so you can feel extra safe, but yet not, um, not uh, sacrifice comfort uh, with your ears. You know, usually if I just put the ear loops on these, they're like all like this way. I look like one of those uh, house elves from Harry Potter. 
and uh, it really strains your ears after a while. This way, this strap here goes onto the other loops. Those go through over your ears as well, but they are not having any uh, pressure on your ears as the strap is attached to the back of your head to the loops themselves, keeping the pressure off your ears completely. And being, uh, you know, on the back of the, the head here, uh, just above the neck, you know, at the base of the skull, uh, you don't even feel them at all. So I think these pack of five straps uh, from Amazon uh, is the answer to a lot of people's pain with wearing uh, one of the surgical max masks uh, N95s or KN95 like this. Uh, if you can't do the gator mask, which is said to not be as safe. All right. Oh, thank you so much. This is Trinidad, the Island Man. Your Island Man doing his unboxing videos. A uh, couple of Amazon Prime boxes. Uh, this weekend, I will try to get into some movies for you. And uh, we'll go ahead and review those. But uh, check out some of these items for your kids, these costumes. Uh, you know, if you're silly enough to wear them yourselves like me, then, uh, you know, check them out for yourself. I'm sure on Amazon Prime Day today and tomorrow it will be far cheaper than what it was. All right. Thank you so much. This is Trinidad, the Island Man, your Island Man, saying mahalo and aloha.